Hey, Thunderpaws team, I wanted to congratulate you with the reviews that you have on this listing. I know how competitive the category can be, so to see this rating is a job well done. Now, my job is to look for potential opportunities with sellers who prioritize on Amazon, like the module that you have on this listing, but you've not filled out. My name is Sean, and I'm with my Amazon guy. So I'm going to point out that module and several other things if you're okay with that. So let's dive right in. Coming over here, I noticed that um, this tool here shows us your keywords, and they're really low. You've only got 643 sponsored, 1,284 organic. Now, you've got the right ratio. We do recommend a one to two ratio and you're spot on with that. But again, these numbers are low. Um, I would recommend at least double. <laughs> so uh, let's do this. I'm going to show you a couple of things. So I'll get out of the way here. And I sorted your keywords by the most frequently clicked on. You see dog, then cat shows up. It's always like that. Then nail file, dog accessories. Surprised you're not there, right? Um, log nail, uh, dog nail grinder. I'm surprised you're not there. You should be there. You should be there. Um, dog grooming supplies. You should have that organically. Yeah. And your page is deep even still. So nail clipper, dog clippers, um, cat nail clipper. Makes sense. Nail trimmer. Nail grinders trimmer for dogs. <clears throat> You're organically ranked 285. Again, I think you should be much higher than this. And let me explain why. 285, 4,600 people are looking for nail grinders trimmer for dogs this month alone. So in addition to the sponsored ads and the other organic ads that are showing up before yours, it's going to be really hard for you to earn your share of the $3.6 million that's going to be generated by nail grinders trimmer for dogs on Amazon this month. So that's just one example. Your organics, though, need improvement. Now, coming over here, I found this listing right here. I took these words. I'll show you dog nail trimmers out of your title and found this listing here. Now, I'm not doing any product comparisons. What I want to show you is this. They're advertising and they've got a good amount of sponsor keywords. So just this alone with their organics is why they're selling more than you. So food for thought on that. Um, and this is just one of your competitors. We always look at at least 10 and look at those keywords and what they're doing, their advertising plan to try and steal share. Now, coming back over to your keywords, I want to show you something that we do in phase three of our three phase SEO process. So right now, let's see, you have 211 organic keywords where you're ranked in spots 20 through 50. And because of that, you're really not benefiting from the organic traffic. So our focus would be to improve your SEO, improve your ranks so that for dog nail trimmers, instead of being 41, we would have you in the top 10. And this would definitely drive more traffic and more revenue and more sales to you. So food for thought on that. Um, also too, it could help with your ACOS if you're not having to sponsor those words. So now back over to your listing. So going through your images, I do uh, like the dog picture that you have on the package, but I wish you had a dog picture in these images. That is one thing I think that would help with more clicks, having a dog in one of these. Um, and we've done studies. The golden retriever is definitely the most clicked on dog <laughs> there is, but I, uh, you know, but for that, but for the dog image missing, I think everything else is okay. This image, uh, I don't, you should get rid of because you can't even read this. Um, so I don't know if I would do that or, Instead of having this infographic like that, which isn't really necessary, just zoom in on this so people can see this. I mean, it looks good, but the way you've got your infographic set up right now, you can't read it. So what's the point of it? Um, and these are kind of hard to read, too. Uh, so dog images, I do recommend that. Now, your title looks nice and long. I love that you got your store and then you've got your, oh, great job about this item section, that's a really good job there. Now, let me show you that module that you have not filled out. If you do anything today, please do this. Log into Seller Central. Log into Seller Central. Just above product description, you see a brand story. 
that is the module that you've not filled out. You can put your brand logo there, thunder paws, talk about how you got your start, why you do what you do, what makes you so special and unique. You can even include a hyperlink on there to your brand store. Um, it takes up real estate and it's right underneath your competition. So you absolutely want to do that. Uh, let's look at your alt text on your images down in your EBC, Thunderpaws logo. Update your alt text, please update it front and back view. If I were going onto Amazon looking for nail clippers for my dog, I'm not going to type in front back view. I'm going to type in dog nail clippers, <laughs> not beginner friendly. Um, so food for thought, your alt text, absolutely. This is a vital part of sending or, or, or helping your listing move up in the ranks and you're not taking advantage of it. Um, I do love the product grid you have down here. Well done on that. Um, so listen, here at my Amazon guy, we're a 200 person, excuse me, 225 people now, person agency, and we manage over 200 brands, giving our clients peace of mind, knowing that Amazon is handled so they can focus on their business. I would really love the opportunity to chat with you though. So please click that link in my email, snag yourself a free consultation, and then I'll email out that competitor analysis to you. But hey, thanks so much for watching. I look forward to speaking with you soon. Take care.